All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21 dropped two patches on today, man. Hey, listen, man. Do we got a patch for next gen, and we got a patch for current Zen? You know what I'm saying? I, I don't think that they really did anything or what have you, but we got all the information and we got all of the real stuff, man. So if y'all don't do nothing else, make sure y'all like the video, man, because liking the video helps us get to that also oh covered at 100k man and uh without further ado let's just get right into it man i got a lot to say a little time to get to it Later. if you make it to c25 that's og status i was told you could be anything just don't be average down bad flat pipes that shit made me a savage start hustling non-stop don't plan on breaking that head so right off the bat man check it out nba 2k 21 like I said, they dropped two patches today, man, and uh, I don't know what the patches have done. But we're gonna talk about it right here. I, I know what I wish that they, they would have done, but, you know, let's just get right into it because I don't want to take up a lot of y'all time, man. Here we go right here. That's the wrong picture. Woo, y'all like that picture in picture, man. Look at that, that boy. I should look at that picture in picture. Look at that up close contest. Anyway, let's just get right to it, man, because I know we got a lot of people that be crying about, ah, I'm just here for the patch notes, not here you. So look, here we go right here. NBA 2K21 patch 8 update, uh, courtside report for current Zen. Uh, a new update is now available on the NBA 2K. Uh, let me, can, I, can I do dark mode? There we go. A new update is available on current Zen uh, version of NBA 2K21. This update brings a number of fixes to my team, updates to player likeness and facial animations, uh, new additions to the 2K beats, and an addition uh, additional fixes to the... Uh, to, to imprint man damn all that look man general uh new seasonal decorations for 2k in the 2k beach i normally do a first look on that but i didn't do it today uh updated another set of player likenesses and improvements for the yeah i know they're both out there man so they had to uh we doing that you know a little bit behind schedule uh keep an eye out for new events coming to the 2k beach in the coming weeks my team resolved some menu issues with the mystery tier uh, uh tier in domination uh duplicated uh, attribute boosting for triangle and uh post post coaches and such uh what was this addressed a win loss exploit in ultimate i mean in unlimited and other multiplayer modes made visual improvements to dark matter uh in certain menus and additional preparation uh blah 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 what is it Addi additional uh, preparations added for future seasons of my team and uh update is available on xbox playstation 4 all this stuff and then we got uh next gen uh court update bro i don't even know how long this is gonna be but look how short these are man an update uh an update is now available blah 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 we look, look at this man the following players have received a number of likenesses updates darius uh darius baisley uh tyler bay uh well i'm not even uh, him and dude diallo uh jamius james ramsey uh the model sabonis little baby sabonis uh luca Samant semantic uh landry shamit and rajon tucker uh let me see resolved a rare issue in nba2 in nba my play uh nba my nba when uh starting and say man nobody don't care about that i'm starting to say from the off season uh we're starting to save from the off season. let me see my team resolve reports uh there's all reported menu issues with with the mystery tier and domination duplicated attribute boost in the triangle address the win loss uh, it, it looks like it's all the same so they really just dropped this so only the names are changed every day it seems we're wasting away let me see uh made and made visual improvements to dark matter reserve resolved an issue with the geologist uh achievement in the trophy and additional preparations added for look bro it was a whole this is just a my team patch bro that's just all this is let's just call it what it is it's a my team patch other than some facial recognition i mean facial updates and stuff like that that just tells me one thing bro they don't care about the part it just is what it is bro they don't care about the part and i get it because you're gonna you're going to support your most lucrative game mode like the most popular game mode is park because it doesn't take a license like how basketball is the most popular game uh 
that people play in the hood because all we need is a basketball and a hoop. Football, you you really need equipment. A lot of people don't want their kids to get hurt and stuff like that. So that's why a lot of people don't play football. But it's one of the safest games. Uh, we don't play soccer really over here like that. So foot, real football, the beautiful game, should be the number one. Because all you really need is two sticks in the ground and a ball of some kind. And you can really get it on. Uh, you know, playing soccer, but then you need cleats and equipment and stuff like that. If you really want to get, you need shin guards and stuff. That's why basketball is the number one game in the hood because it's the least. All you need is some shoes and a hoop and a ball and or a bat or a milk crate or something. You just need some a ball and some a bicycle rim. Something. Hey, let me know if you played on the bicycle rim or something. We just need a ball and something for that ball to go through, and we just need to put it a reasonable amount of feet off the ground. If we can do that. We can play basketball. We can hoop. And that's just how the game has always been. That's how the game goes, man. And this same thing with the park. It's the it's the game mode that requires the least resources to put toward it. That's why it's one because people ain't got no whole bunch of money out here. So as a as a result, obviously it doesn't make a lot of money. And because it doesn't make a lot of money, they're not gonna pay the most attention to it. But anytime something wrong with my team or something like that, they right on it. You see it, man. Look, resolved menu issues we've had menu issues foul corrupted and all this stuff for all of this time they never fixed it and they never like i don't know man you can't load players but if you couldn't load up one of those my player cards though i bet they'll fix that instantly if it was a my player glitch or a vc glitch that people was using for my hey they're gonna fix that but the actual game that most people are playing like i said the most fun game mode is probably wreck and then um and then pro-am and stuff like that but park is the most played game mode obviously so you know it is what it is i don't know man like i just feel like we getting the long end of the stick the short end of the stick the long end the long end of the uh pause you know what i'm saying but it is what it is it sucks but that's just how it is this is how business goes now let me tell you one thing if y'all really want to improve my team my career all that good stuff we gotta have cross play bro there's no reason that a game like Outriders with not a whole lot of money behind, like people can fly is the people that made it, right? They said it's the same people that made Gears uh, 4. I think it is or what have you, but that ain't the point. The point is if a small unknown game can come out, have cross play and cross gen cross play, and it's way more going on in that game than it is in a game of 2K. Way more endless waves of monsters endless just it's it's so much going on bullets flying you got powers going off all this stuff they can have it and make it work in a dumbed down version on last gen and and, and everybody can play together then they they can do this with 2k i feel like i might be wrong binary let me know if you see anything in the 2ks that you feel like gameplay what basketball wise that couldn't be done we ain't talking about the environment and all this stuff we talking about basketball wise I don't think it's anything that can't be done. That small game, that game that no, you can you you get a code, you can join. We got its own friend list. Call of Duty can do it. Uh, like my boy T said, damn Need for Speed patch crossplay in the first game that had. You got Fortnite patched it in. Uh, we got um Apex that patched it in. We got all of that stuff going on, and 2K act like trades up big whites. Uh, 2K act like they can't do it, man. Like I don't get it. But it needs to be done. We don't want just cross play. We want cross gen, cross play. What we want is we want to be able to play against, uh, you know, like I guess it really don't matter what I say. But y'all let me know if I'm wrong. We want last gen and current gen to be able to play together. That's where we at with it. We don't care about nothing else. We want last gen, current gen, everybody to play together. And they ain't got this whole myth about the game being held back or whatever you don't hold back the future console with the last console okay you just dumb it down for them you dumb it down for them and then that way they you know what i'm saying when they get up there then they still see a little boost because they're on a machine that's capable of doing more now i'm not i ain't like i said i don't do all the programming stuff like that like i just don't see nothing that that last gen look this is current gen this current gen right here I don't see anything that it don't even really look different. It moves different and stuff like that. But bro, the gear is more fi and all this stuff, man. I don't see anything basketball wise that I don't think that they could accomplish on current gen. Uh, this on, I mean, on current gen, this on next gen. I just don't see it. Dumb the city down, take the city out that nobody don't want. But they didn't dumb down Outriders. It's just the whole game. Just make the graphics more. Just make the graphics fifty percent more 
and then we good, man, or something like that. I don't know. Whatever you got to do, but let let's get this. At least let's get crossplay in. People gonna be talking about the servers and stuff. Guess what? Outriders got server issues. Guess what they do? They put up a bulletin saying we are aware that crossplay between PC and consoles is having some issues, and as such, we're going to you know what I'm saying. We as such, we're gonna go ahead. And uh, we, we're working on the issue, and we'll let y'all know when it gets resolved. They put out a bulletin. Why 2K can't do something like that, man? I don't know, man. You know, it is what it is. Look, man. And then the current Zen versus... Bro, I'm a demon on this, this current Zen. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. You ain't gotta have no Zen to play over here. But, like, I just don't get it. Like, people cry about current Gen versus next Gen. And the thing is, with current Gen, they just be saying... Well, you can do everything on next gen, and I bought a PS5 for nothing and stuff. Bro, if you only play one game, bro, yeah, you probably did buy it for nothing because that's on you. I I play Call of Duty on both of them, and I know you're the first thing somebody going to say, well, you can play Call of Duty on but you can't play it in 120 frames per second on both. And that's a big sticking issue with me. If you don't have, hold on a second, trays up! Green Bean Money Team Splash Down. If you don't have all the high-tech equipment that I got and stuff like that, I get it. I get it. Yes, maybe you should have stayed on last console, but that should be the sticking point right there. Like, if these other games can do it, and Call of Duty, like, some people fine with playing in 60 frames. I'm not. Some people fine with playing Apex and games like that in 60 frames. I'm not. That's why I play Apex on the PC. Trades up! Splash down! That's why I play Apex and stuff like that on the PC. Uh, some people like playing all these other games. I am one of those people that like to play games at the highest potential and the highest frames. That's what I like to do. I get if you don't like to do that, then they should give you the option to just stay on your PlayStation uh, 4 or whatever and just do whatever you want to. But I got a PlayStation 4, I should be able to play, they should be able to dumb the game down and just let everybody play together because obviously the community is going to be split and all that again. Bro, we ain't trying to go for all that. Anyway, man, I don't know, bro. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Do y'all think that they could play if they took the city out of the game or whatever, or at least dumb down the city for... They, I don't even think they got to dumb down the city to be real with you and let me tell you why. Because... If these vast ass worlds can be can be perpetuated on on these other consoles with these other games, Division got a big world. All these Division Two got a big world. All these other games got big worlds. Monster Hunter worked just fine. All that stuff works just fine on the current gen. Yes, yes, next gen gives you more freedom. But let's be real, man. It ain't that big of a difference. That's all I'm saying. Like the graphically, graphically, and watching this game play, it ain't that big of a difference, or what have you. And that's the only thing people are gonna be talking about anyway. I don't think nobody really cares about the graphics. We just want to play together. And if we can't get crossplay at least between Xbox and PlayStation and stuff like this, see, it used to have a, that used to be a, a built-in excuse. Microsoft and and Sony won't allow it. Blah blah blah. Then Microsoft said Sony, y'all can use our service. Sony said they don't want to do it. And then. All the other people said it. They tried to blame it on Fortnite. Fortnite said, you know what, we'll work around it. And then a few months later, Sony and Microsoft began working together. And then they said, yo, y'all can, any anybody, any developer that wants to do crossplay, they got the wherewithal. Because the way that they're playing it is literally just the internet. I don't want to sit here and have to buy the game. And it ain't that many people doing it anyway. I shouldn't have to buy the game. And I'm not going to do it. But I already bought the game for both of them, so I don't really care about that. I shouldn't have to wait until I get the PlayStation 5 to play with T. I should be able to play with it from my Xbox. Or if I want to play with it from my PlayStation, I should be able to play with it from my PlayStation. Because let's just be real. They already showed us that, look, we already updating the game. We already doing cross-gen updates. Look at that. It's the same exact update. This is the same exact information, damn near. So we doing cross-gen updates, but we can't get cross-play. I ain't never getting a damn logo. I don't even care either, man. Every time they, every time they got logo damn, we have to stream. Guess what I'm doing? I'm always doing something in the real world. And I'm fine with that. Because my life don't revolve around the game or gaming. It's just weird that I just don't understand why we can't, why can't we do this? I, I know that 39 her hand. I know that they can give us a more dumbed down version of the game on current gen that plays, even if it plays like complete dog. It's fine. 
if it's on current gen, that gives you a reason to upgrade and get to the greatness that is next gen. But it just feels like, it just, I don't know, man. It just feels lazy to me, man. And maybe that he tried to do the big spin drop and all this stuff. Like people, I don't like current gen. Everybody can do everything. But every time everybody makes a video, a content creator makes a video with it. Oh my God, guys, this bill can just do everything. So it's fine for you to be able to do everything. But when everybody else can do it, hold on one second. Trades up. Green bean money team splash down. It's fine for you to be able to do everything, right? But when everybody else can do everything, then it's a problem. Oh my God, guys, this build is so awesome. It can just do everything. That's every, that's what, this literally what every, and this build can do everything. You know what I'm saying, son? And this build can just do everything. And, and, and you know what I'm saying, my guy? This build can really do everything. Like, this is everybody in the 2K community. But when we get a game where your build can, can actually do everything, but it really can't because if you skip out on defense and you can't do everything, then it's a problem. They just tell me that the 2K community, I, it's just like, I want to be able to do everything for no reason. I want you to be able to do nothing. That's how I did. Anyway, man, I, I don't already talked long enough, man. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed the video. Let me know what y'all think. I got to get back to work. Come by the stream tonight. We playing Outriders. If you got it, I am the best techno master in the game. And uh, I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Town. Guys, please. Guys, please.